Hi guys, thanks for watching and uh, just going to make a wee quick video here uh, as quickly as I can really to be honest with you but uh, just quickly to show a lot of these, these new wee motors I came across online the wee motor by Gart in these particular motors is the ML2212S version and uh, there's a couple of different types of these motors online I'm sure if you have come across this make uh, Gart uh, it was my first time coming across them and I decided to go ahead and buy them so uh, Anyway, just a quick look, uh, obviously we have the ML2212S 920KV motors. The S stands for shaft. You will find uh, a GART ML2212s as well, but without the S. The S means they have no shaft and uh, they come with holes in the top. Uh, you can fit uh, prop adapters to it or uh, you can fit just normal T-type propellers. But this type here I'll be using on my F550 Hex and uh, I'm using uh, 1045 propellers on it so uh, that's why I went ahead and got these ones. And I have to say overall quality, uh, I've seen a couple of videos on YouTube regarding these little motors. Uh, one or two shows them a, a green version of these having a slight motor or a noise coming from the motor. I have to say I've run these before and uh, I have to say I'm really impressed with the quality of them. They come from the factory pre-balanced and that uh, you guys probably won't be able to see to be honest with you but uh, in below the tops of the motor here just in below on the side we have the grub screw in here to tighten onto the shaft of uh, the motor uh, but in below here on the top of the housing there's actually small little weights on the opposite side from the screw there's small little weights on the underside of in here and I've ran these and I have to say I'm very pleased with the quality now this is an old uh, BEC of mine I'm not too sure if it's going to be working it's an old one and uh, just for test here we'll try and hook it up quickly and see but I was really surprised all these motors I bought a set of six of them three clockways and three counterclockways and uh, they all came very well balanced, they ran them up well balanced and the wee nuts and all awful lot of people are having problems with these as well with the uh, I can't find any at hand but the standard wee black and silver ones that would come for your clockwise and counterclockwise motors the wee aluminium black ones are normally out of balance there we go these wee boils here are normally really out of balance whenever you think you have everything sorted you put your motors on, run it, everything's nice and smooth before you put your props on, you put these on your motors just to see and uh, lo and behold, the thing's vibrating like mad well that's normally a sign that these wee, motor, these wee nuts are probably well out of balance they're machined and fired out and mass produced in the thousands and uh, they're never balanced, they're checked for quality I'm sure they're just pumped out, threaded and bang away you go these nuts here pretty light but they feel pretty heavy and tough the, the motor actually feels pretty heavy and tough overall quality I have to say I'm very pleased with you know definitely uh, a good job so we'll see if we're going the right way around here or not I put the wrong connection on that oh dear oh. so sorry about that getting a bit of shaking here off my wee workbench and stuff so we'll hook this up and we'll see. And we're not even paired up with this transmitter to this receiver. Should be just a matter of there we go, we're paired up. So, hopefully this will run. There you go. And like that, there's no vibration off that at all. I'm barely holding it. Look, one finger, sitting on one finger, it's spinning away there. I'm shaking a little bit. My elbow's resting on the edge of the bench. But that's that running it. Must have been going the right direction there, I reckon, because that nut. Obviously, these are self-tightening. 
Yeah, so we were spinning the right direction there. Whenever I powered up the throttle, you watch the nut and you'll see the nut self tightening, and that's what they're supposed to do. Obviously, I'm slowing down because it's not tight and tight, and I've tried to stack it a little bit, but. But you feel that in your hand, honestly. Brilliant, wee quality motor. I haven't. I haven't put this on my build yet, but I will be putting these probably onto my, my F550 or maybe buy it or building an S550 frame, hexacopter frame, and that's what I'll be using these motors for. But uh, I have to say, they're definitely getting the thumbs up from me. We motors by Gart, not a very well made or uh, well heard of make, but the finish of these wee motors is brilliant. They're really good quality. You can see they're being pressed together quite well, nice and neat, no big gaps. The gap right round. The motor seat and everything from the motor coils and magnets is even the whole way around. I know sometimes some motors, the wee cheap ones that you buy, maybe at two or three pound a pop, you know, be off balance and stuff. These are finished really well. The wires coming into the base of the motor are all epoxy resin in the place. So it saves you having to do that with the cheaper motors. Everything's already pre-done for you. All the thread holes in the bottom of the motor it's all finished, nice good finish. The windings on the coils look nice and tight. There's a good finish, good feel to the wee motor. And uh, I'll get a wee thrust test done with these here. Get a wee thrust test put online. But for now, if you haven't heard of these wee motors, these little Gart ML2212S motors, ideal for 450 and 550 builds. Plus loads of other builds as well. But they get the thumbs up from me. Overall quality is very good. Feels nice and tight balance is brilliant and uh, I would advise you if you're looking at these online and you haven't maybe heard of them I would advise you just to go for it and get them for the price of them versus quality definitely for maybe a first build they're by no means the high end of the market but for the in the middle somewhere where, where they are quality is definitely definitely there with them I'm very happy with them and I hope if you just go for these two that you're not disappointed seen some videos on YouTube, people saying about them smoking and stuff like that. I've seen them, the videos, and what's happened is people have put screws right up until they're actually touching the coil and they're wondering why sparks is flying at them. <laughs> I've seen it, trust me. But uh, that's their own fault, I reckon. But overall, I can't wait to get these on my build, and we'll see how they perform. You know, but uh, thumbs up for me. Good wee job. The wee Gart ML2212S motors. Good job. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.